Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, everybody. Mr. Jimmy coming to you one more time this morning. Yes, it's me. It's me. It's me. Another day, another dollar. Time to make that big KW holler. Oh, yeah. Got to get a get ahead of start. Got to turn a wheel. Because if the wheels ain't turning, we ain't earning. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> I just like to say that, you know. I work on the time clock. <clears throat> Yeah, I work. I work on the time clock. I just get like and get it and I start. Let's check this mailbox. See if we got any bills in here. Oh, no bills. No bills for today. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. That's a good start. I always like to check my mailbox in the morning. I check it in the evening time, but I like to check it in the morning too. Sometimes. Oh, sometimes the mail runs late. Sometimes you know, you don't know what might happen mail carrier might be behind time and might be running late so i always check my mailbox twice i check it in the mornings and i check it in the evenings when i get home from work anyway folks we rolling strong this morning if this is the first time you've stumbled across this video and don't know what i'm about allow me to introduce myself i am mr jimmy i live over here in the middle of ori community Yes, it's a little community, and the name of it is Ori Community. Right here to the right, across the trees here, is where the old Ori Elementary School was, where I went to elementary school. It's a restaurant now, though. Yep, used to go to that little elementary school there called Ori Elementary. That's right, folks, right here in Ori Community. Spent my whole life here, really. Spent my whole life, just about my whole life here. Anyway, folks... Born and raised on the farm, on in the backer fields and hay fields and all that kind of stuff. Good for young people. Anyway, folks, we're rolling strong here in the Ori community, right smack dab in the middle of Ori County, which is located in the upper right hand corner of the state of South Carolina, right along the east coast of the United States of America. On this big, beautiful planet we call Earth, my friends. And I do these videos in the morning time just to talk to you, just to get the thoughts off the top of my head, get off, get whatever's been bugging my head, and whatever's been uh, jumbled up in there, I try to shake it loose in the morning time before I get to work so that I can be focused on my job. And of course, my phone's going to ding, ding, ding while I'm trying to make me a video. You know what I'm saying? Always oh, does. But that's all right. It's all right. Everybody want to say it? good morning to me i like to say good morning on social media on facebook if you don't know it i am on uh, facebook uh you can find my information down in the description area of this video i'm on facebook i like to say good morning every morning just say it to everybody all at one time and i truly mean it to every single person that i know good morning to you i hope you have a super awesome day i hope everything goes your way that's the way i think that's my mindset. I wake up every morning. I'm just like everybody else. Though. I wake up every morning. I sit up on the side of the bed. I said, oh, Lord, take me now. You know, my body be aching a little bit. You know, I'm like, oh, I got to do this again. Another day, another day. But then I stop. And then I collect myself. And then I say, thank you, Lord, for another day. Another wonderful day on this big, beautiful planet we call Earth. I get another day to restart and to try to make another friend, an extra friend, more friends. That's what it's all about, just sharing smiles and being nice and just enjoying your life while it's here because once it's gone, it's gone, zip, in the period, that's it. Boom, end. And you know when you're gone, people gonna forget about you. When I'm gone, people gonna forget about me. But is it gonna affect me? No, because I'll be gone. I won't exist anymore. That's the big reality. That's the big reality. Um, big reality that uh, that uh, hits hard is uh, once you bite the dust, you no longer exist here. You no longer exist here. You 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 don't have to worry about. Well, I want to do this when I go. Why? Uh, you no longer exist. Nothing is going to matter here on this earth to you anymore you won't exist here on this earth anyway folks not to get into that no cause no drama no hardship no no down points or anybody 
I know everybody has their own opinions on everything, and that's one thing that I want to push on my channel is that this is strictly my opinions, my thoughts, my ideas, my suggestions. Whatever I say on this channel is for me and me alone. I'm not trying to offend anybody or try to piss anybody off. I'm not trying to criticize anybody. What I say on this channel is only for me and my thoughts, how I live my life, and how I see things. That's it. Don't take nothing I say serious. Don't be offended by anything that I say. It's just my opinions. And uh, a bunch of trucks, dump trucks heading out early this morning under 501. Anyway, folks, don't take anything I say too serious. Just be happy. Don't worry. Life's good. It can be better, but it can be worse. It's up to you. You know, I wake up, you know, every day, like I say, you know, and, and I have my trials and tribulations, and I have all the stress and drama and all, you know, I have all that stuff just like everybody else, but it's, it's all depends on how you choose to live your life, how you choose to let these things bother you. Because it's like they say, worry will make you age faster. It'll put wrinkles on your face. It'll put gray hairs in your hair. But that's worry. That's stress. That's what the stuff does. Plus, stress will cause you to hurt. will cause you to uh, have pains, aches all over your body because it's just stress. The stress is something strong and powerful that uh, it will cause, uh, cause problems. So try not to be stressed out or too much about things because it will age you quick. And if you're trying to hold on to that youthful look, just wake up every day and think about positive things. Just think about good things. Just be think about happy things. Think about the things that make you happy each day. Because your time's running now. You better start looking at it. You better start thinking about that hourglass. Because every little green sand that falls through that hourglass, you ain't getting it back. It's gone. This moment right now that you're hearing me talk right this second, it's gone. Boom. It's gone. Never coming back. Never getting it back. You can play it back. You can listen to it again. But you will never get that moment back. That moment's gone. This moment here. Boom. It's gone. Okay. Understand that, folks. Understand. Every second. Boom. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's like passing somebody on a highway in a in a in a in a strange town or a town you've never been to before, and you pass by somebody. All right, let me think about it. Here's a good, here's a good, uh, here's a good, a, uh, association. Okay, say you're riding down the road right here, never been here before, and you're traveling across the, the, the country. You pass somebody on the side of the road right there, they smile a wave at you, you smile a wave back at them. You'll never see them again. You'll never see him again. That was that moment. That was that moment in time. That you made contact, eye contact. You waved, they waved, they smiled, you smiled. Boom, and they're gone. Think of that as each day of your life. Think of it as each day of your life. And that day comes, and you're enjoying it, or either you're stressed out, or you're you letting something bother you, or whatever. And that day goes by, it's gone. You'll never get that day back. So if you spend that day being depressed, if you spend that day being negative, when it's gone, it's gone. You'll never get it back to redo it, to replay it, and have a happy day. That day's gone. You lost that day. It's gone. It's like the pages on the calendar, you know, it's gone. You know, I, you know, sometimes when something goes on, you say, oh, man, I wish I'd have caught that event. Well, I wish I could have went to that event. Or when they have, a, you know, a festival, oh, I wish I would have went to that festival, or I wish I would have went to that bike week, or I wish I would have went to that Christmas parade, or I wish I would have went to that birthday party. And wishing that you would have, but you didn't, it's gone. You don't like you get a replay and get the well, I get another chance to do it. No, it's gone. It's completely gone. That's how your days of your life are. Each day. Value each day. Value it. Value that day. Because once the day's gone, it's gone. You're not getting it back. It's gone. 
that's how important today is. It only comes once in your lifetime. Each day comes once in your lifetime. Most people wonder why I treat people the way I do. Most people wonder why I have the attitude that I have. Most people wonder why I'm so happy all the time. But it, ain't, it ain't the fact that I'm happy all the time. I have my hard times that I, I struggle with. But it's the mindset that today, right now, I'll never get this day back. So if I spend it moping and crying and pouting and all kinds of drama going on, that's how that day will be spent and I'll never get it back. Boom, it's gone. It's gone. Now I know we have healing moments that so we have to. We have to cry. We have to uh, pout. We have to uh, humble down and all that kind of stuff. I understand that. But don't let it rob you of your happiness. You understand? Don't let it rob you of your happiness. You know, there's people out in the world that's wishing they would die right now. There's people out there. Seriously. Now, if you're listening to this video, you never felt that way. You don't understand. You don't, you don't, you don't realize it. But there's people right now that are wishing that they would just die. They're just tired. They, just, they don't want to live because they're so caught up in the drama. and so caught up in the stress and the worries and everything that's beating them down, they're so caught up into it that they want to give up. They want to just die. They want to die. It's true. People, there's people that's just like, oh, just take me now, Lord. I just, oh, just want to die. I can't take this no more. It's killing me. Nothing goes my way. Nothing works out for me. I'm not getting anywhere. Just go ahead and take me right now. There's people that have that mindset and think that way I'm a true believer and when your time comes your time comes you can try to avoid it here and there and get lucky and everything but when your time comes it comes there's no need in worried about when it's going to come there's no need in preparing for when it comes because when it comes boom it's gone it's, it's gone it's like dropping your keys in the river boom Let's go. Ain't no need to worry about it. You ain't gonna find them. Unless you're lucky enough with some magnets and all that kind of stuff. And you all that kind of, you know. No need to worry. Go. Anyway, folks. I get on here about these videos because it's stuff that's on my mind. I wake up each day. Stuff on my mind. So I try to, I try to share it with you. And I try to break it down into the certain things that most people will understand. And, you know. And I may stretch a little bit more on the topic than just the thought that might have went through my head. Um, that car there, I can, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's just, just trying to talk and, and about things that may affect you in your life. And I don't know. I do. Uh, I know I struggle with things each and every day. I'm struggling right now. I still got some pain in my my neck and shoulder. Um, and I'm struggling with it each and every day. Uh, it's getting better and better. I spent the whole Memorial Day weekend um, in pain and hurting. Um, and I don't hurt very often. It's, it takes a lot to, to cripple me a little bit, you know. I'm going to tell you what, that, that, that put some pain in me. It had me laid up. Um, but I'm healing. Now, this week is going, going through. It's already Thursday morning. And uh, I, I, was, I injured my neck and shoulder. I don't know. It had to have been end of last week. Um... I don't know how, if it come from whiplash in the work truck, it happened at work, it had de definitely happened at work. Uh, but I don't know exactly when. Either whiplash or twisting or turning or whatever it was. Um, so, today's Thursday, so tomorrow will be one week of this pain, but it's slowly going away. Um, I've been taking, um, not 
prescription drugs or anything like that. I've just been taking some vitamins and uh, uh, every now and then I'll take some, some of that bear uh, back and body pain, bear, uh, if you want to call it aspirin or not, but it's bear, bear aspirin, uh, makes that, anyway, I take that if the pain gets to hurt me or whatever, bad. Um, but not very often. I've taken it probably three times, maybe, in a, in a week's time. Um, I'm not really big on taking pills or anything like that. I don't like putting forward substances in my body or anything like that. So I, I always keep at a minimum of taking any kind of any kind of painkillers or anything like that. Um, and putting a little patch or whatever that a healing patch or whatever that you can buy. I don't know the name of it right off, but I put that on the sore areas where, the, where it hurts the most. And uh, it kind of, I don't know if it really does anything. I can feel the heat from it, you know, but I don't really know if it really does any good. Um, I'm a true believer in only time heals the pain in every situation. Uh, but uh, let's try to eat the right things, all that kind of stuff. Got to heal your body. Got to heal your body. It's healing slow. Um, sometimes, yeah, you know, it's like it's not even there. There's no pain whatsoever. And then you'll like be moving along, or I'll be driving along here, and all of a sudden I'll reach to 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 turn the wheel or whatever a certain way, and all of a sudden it'll kind of like almost like uh, almost like somebody pinching you almost. Uh, be a sharp pulling muscle by any kind of pain or something I don't know um, but that's just but then then other times it's like nothing there I can turn any way, reach any way don't feel a thing I don't know it's just positioning of the muscles and everything but anyway enough about me enough about me, my goodness my goodness, I'm a grown ass man <laughs> I'm a grown ass man complaining about my muscle hurting or whatever. Uh, that's what the world's uh, lacking these days is real men, you know? Real men. We gotta toughen up. We gotta push forward. We can't let things knock us down. Can't let things keep us down. We gotta go. We gotta protect the people of this world, the women and children, you know? That's why we need to be real men. Yeah, some of them don't want to be real men anymore. They want to put on a dress and high heels and makeup. I don't know what's up with that right there. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with y'all. Uh, anyways. <laughs> anyways, folks, uh, it's going to be a fantastic day. And I'm just going to be me because that's the best that's the best position I have, because uh, can't nobody else be me better than I can be me. Just all this to, you know, folks, I, I really do appreciate each and every one of you. I know I don't have that many subscribers. I know I don't have that many likes or comments and all that kind of stuff. I know I don't. Y'all probably wonder why I get on here every day and just keep talking. I don't even, you know, it's not, I'm not getting paid by YouTube or anything like that. I'm not getting no paycheck. I ain't getting no, you know, reimbursement or anything from making videos. I've told y'all time and time before, if you look at my other videos, I, I make videos just for me. And when I'm dead and gone, if I don't live to see tomorrow, people can look back at these videos and listen to me run my mouth and how I thought leave a legacy of it. And it don't matter to me once I'm gone. That matters to me now. But it won't matter to me after I'm gone. So, it matters to me that I want to try to bring a smile to somebody's face. I want to try to bring happiness to somebody's life. And that's the way I am. I'm not the best person in the world by far. I am not 
perfect in any way. And I don't pretend to be better than I am. I just strive to be better than I was yesterday. Yesterday's gone. Push that restart button and just try to be better. Just try to live better. Try to love harder. That's all we got right now. I know there's people in my life that I probably don't associate with. That I, you know, and it's not that I don't love them. It's not that I don't care about them. It's just that. I'm just not that sociable a person really in life. I am very quiet. I keep to myself. I really do. I keep to myself. And I apologize if it if it, if it you know hurts your feelings or anything that I'm that I don't speak out very much. I don't call or talk or text or anything. It's just who I am. I'm a quiet person. Now, if I talk to somebody all the time, it's because you know, I'm trying to socialize, like, you know, being with somebody, and uh, that's, that's, just doing stuff like that. They got going on here, that car driver's left. Uh, roll up to the yard, truck yard here. Somebody at the fuel pump was like. See what they're doing. Is that a fuel truck? What is that? I don't know. We'll find out here shortly. Anyway, folks, we are pulling up on the truck yard this morning. By all means, I do thank y'all for watching my videos. Thank you. Shout out to all my subscribers, all the people that take the time to watch the videos, all the people that comment, all the people that give me a thumbs up. All the people that support my channel just by watching it. Just by being my friend. Just by being who you are. I thank each and every one of you. Everybody is special to me. And I appreciate each and every one of you. That's why I always say, if y'all got to be out and about on the highways and byways of this big beautiful planet we call her... By all means, do be safe and courteous and nice and do help somebody if you can. As long as it's safe for y'all to do so because always be aware of your surroundings all the, all the time. But until next time, this is Mr. Jimmy and I love you and I miss you and I appreciate you. And until next time, Peace out, my friends. Peace out. Now let's get this truck checked out. Get the wheels turning. Because this big boy's got to get some work done.